Okay. Are we ready, people? Sing along. Oh, check your filament diameter. It's probably set too high. Oh, check your filament diameter. Give 1.79 a try. Check your filament, check your filament, check your filament diameter. Check your filament diameter. It's probably set too high. See, the thing is, the new uh, the settings on Replicator G by default are set to a filament diameter of about 1.68 or 1.63, depends on which version you get, which for a new roll of filament is probably too high. Your filament, the brand new filament coming in is probably at about 1.75 or 1.8. So 1.79 is a good place uh, to start. If you have a set of digital calipers, you can measure it to get a more accurate reading. Or what I like to do, even though I have a set of digital calipers, I still use this. It is a uh, little doohickey that I have on Thingiverse called the Filament Diameter Tester by Simon, which is neat. Uh, you print these two little doohickeys out and then you mate them together and if they hold without your help they'll come apart with just a little tug then you know that your filament diameter is set properly um, check if, if, if you're printing and your prints seem too squishy like they're coming off the side your filament diameter might be too low uh, if you're printing and it's coming out real stringy and not filling in that first layer, your filament diameter is too high. There are other things you can check. There's there's uh, plate height and there's leveling, plate leveling. But for me, number one tip, check your filament diameter. That one setting for me has solved a multitude of problems. Sing you this little song today. <laughs> 